तो इनके घर से हम औरतों के बेट में जो बच्चा है कोक में से निकाल के मारेंगे तो इन स्वरों की करो विदाई But more proof of the fact that Hinduism is no different than Islam, and Hinduism has every intent of waging a Hindu holy war, as I sometimes call it a Hindu jihad, against non-Hindus in India. I showed in my other video a clip of these Hindu terrorists handing out these trident-like knives to other Hindus and essentially telling them to go out and wage war. Well, in this case, you have a bunch of Hindu uh, female youths being given the same kinds of trident-type weapons and swords by two very large Hindu terrorist organizations, which, by the way, have hundreds of thousands and millions of members. You know, one of them has over a million members, and one of them, the other one has, a, has at least several hundred thousand. So it shows how widespread Hindu terrorism is, not just a few isolated instances. This is Hinduism. It's no different than Islam. It is a religion of terrorism. Check this out. श्री राम तथा मां दुर्गा का स्मरण कर मैं प्रतिज्ञा करती हूँ कि अपने पवित्र हिंदू धर्म हिंदू संस्कृति तथा हिंदू समाज की सुरक्षा करूंगी हिंदू राष्ट्र की Verses like Proverbs 8, verse 36 perfectly describe Hinduism. But think about Genesis uh, 16, verse 11 and 12. I use it to describe Islam quite a lot. But when it talks about wild wild men, you know, it definitely is describing Islam, but it also can be applied to Hinduism as well. I'm not saying that Hindus are descendants of Ishmael. I'm just saying that description wild men cert most certainly applies to the false religion of Hinduism as well. It can be, it can be applied. So that's the truth of the matter. Hinduism is a wild, primitive, false religion, just like Islam. And stuff like this proves it. It's a religion all about death. It's death worship. You know, John 8, 44 shows the roots of Hinduism. It's of the devil. And Hinduism and Islam are just two sides of the same Luciferian coin, same Luciferian Jesuit Antichrist coin. You know, they're fighting against each other, but really, you know, it's just two forms of Satanism that can't agree with each other. So, and stuff like this proves it. Hinduism has full intent of waging a holy war in Hindu jihad against non-Hindus and make India Hindu theocracy. And by the way, you think it's just India? There have been, right here in Canada, there have been cases of Hindus going out and uh, trying to silence criticism of Hinduism. So the idea that, you know, the Hindus are just some kind of peaceful, pluralistic people being persecuted by the Muslims, no, they're every bit as violent as the Muslims. And stuff like this is just proof of that. So I wanted to point that out. This this may offend some people, but I honestly don't care. Truth is the truth, no matter what. You know, I mean, this, this is their own... This is their own words. They're openly saying they're handing out swords and handing out tridents and everything else. So yeah, may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye.